Hey guys, it's Friday and I'm full of energy and I'm happy. So let's see what's happened. Monday, public holiday, woke up late, was drunk the day before. I didn't really do anything, I think. Uh, Tuesday, stayed at home, didn't really do anything. Wednesday, just work. Thursday, just work. So, nothing new there. You know, just work. I've been trying to, trying to get some school stuff done, but I really, I really can't concentrate on doing school stuff. I really just want to enjoy being here and working and just... Uh, school stuff is really annoying. So today I am going to go to Asakusa and go to the Sensoji Temple, Sensoji Shrine, go through Nakamisa Street. Then I just wanted to show you guys, guys that I'm getting serious about like studying Japanese again. So you know, before I got here I actually bought this Japanese uh, activity book. For hiragana, and yesterday I sat down in the living room, and I wrote all the hiragana syllables. Started with like numbers, um, so I can almost read all the hiragana now. But you know they have ka katakana as well, and then they have kanji, and you actually kind of need to be able to read all three writing systems to be able to read um, Japanese so I still have a, a far way to go but I need to start somewhere and I'm actually thinking about studying Japanese when I get home again just like night school so I, that I can speak it fluently at some point I think that would be really cool Hey guys I'm now at Saksa and if you remember last time when I was here in 2016 I drew a fortune that you do over here, like you, you make a wish, you shake the can, and then out the sticks come, and then find the candy on the stick of the door, and you get a piece of paper there. So, last year I got the worst fortune, like bad luck, bad fortune, and this time, motherfuckers! I have the best fortune. The thing I didn't do last time is that I got the bad fortune and it was, um, apparently when you get the bad fortune you're supposed to like like tie it into thing right here. But I just took it home. So maybe that bad fortune followed me around. But this time I have good fortune. I can feel it in my fingers. It's gonna be awesome. So let me just show you a bit around. So I already went through Nakamisa Street, bought some stuff. We have the sun is like in the way. And this is the temple. Oh, fortune. There's a lot of people wearing kimonos as well. It's so kawaii. Uh, so yeah. I'm just chilling, just walking around, not wanting to do anything specific, but you know, it's just nice being here. Hey guys, it's now Saturday at 2 o'clock, I think. Yesterday... Oh my god, I forgot to close my fucking... Well, that's been open all night. Okay, so yesterday, Sid... Rishi, Gaku, Kelly, Sonny, and me went clubbing. It was fucking crazy. We went to one club first, Elo Tokyo, I think. And there was like no people there at all. So we were there for maybe, we just got a drink and then we left like an hour later. Then we went to another one, do not remember the name of it. We stood in line for an hour. And they didn't, like, you know, the girls could get in way faster, but they didn't want to let us girls in because the bounce, bouncer thought that... Bouncer? Is that what it's called? Yeah, bouncer. Thought that Kelly was too drunk, so we waited with the guys. When we actually got in, it was, like, totally fine. It was insane. I... 
Um, I don't remember everything from yesterday. I remember like bits and pieces, but I don't really remember the conversations I've had. I'm kind of dying a little inside because like this didn't even happen in the club. This happened when we were on the way to the club. Yeah, look at that. So I'm gonna reveal to you and to myself how bad the damage actually is underneath. Oh my god, no! This thing didn't do shit! Oh my god! My phone is actually this cracked up! Look! What? Can't even fucking think, man. So, guys, just a really quick round up for the last days. I already told you what happened Saturday. No. I told you what happened Friday. Friday I went out clubbing. You've already heard about that. Saturday. Uh, when I woke up, I went out to get some food with Sid. We came back. Sid was going to go clubbing again. I almost went with him, but yeah. So um, we did what we almost do every weekend. We watched horror movies. We watched It, the new one. And we watched Don't Knock Twice. And I feel like we watched another one, but we watched a, a romantic comedy mo first. That's why. I don't remember what that one was called. Then uh, I woke up late Sunday. I went to Shibuya to get my phone fixed. So it is now fixed with the new tempered glass. Um, I had to pay almost 900 Danish crowns to get the phone replaced or the, the screen replaced. And I'm gonna email my insurance to see if they can cover it because I think it should. Uh, and then after we actually got it fixed, um, Friday, um, I met like a group of American, American guys, which like they live like way north up and they're just staying in Tokyo for a little while. So yesterday, um, one of them texted me to ask if I was like gonna do anything because they were gonna go clubbing, but I obviously had work the day after, so I couldn't do that. Um, so uh, Sid, me, and Risha, we went to go karaoke. And then the American guys, they actually joined us, and it was crazy. We rapped, we growled, we sang a lot of different kind of songs. It was fun. We were there at the karaoke place for like three hours. Like, we, we just asked them to just give it an, an hour, but every time that one hour was almost up, we were like, ah, oh, let's just stay an hour more and fuck work. But, yeah, so um, I ended that this week with some awesome karaoke so thanks for watching this vlog guys I'll see you in the next one